I've noticed that a lot of these deep water spots have no one building near them. And the ones that do have these sloping water colliders. So I figured I'd teach people the little trick I use. Now, these water collectors and generators don't actually have to touch dirt. They have to be in water. And I know that's a little bit of a weird comment, but I'll show you. See, as you can see, these are all lined up, even though I am in pretty deep water. Now, you can use the new camera mode that lets you fly around, but I'm going to use just the original way. So I've got Aqua Boy on so that I can just work in water. So if I just hop in here and swim down, you see that I just simply built a foundation. And these are just resting on the foundation. And that lets me pretty much build out, as you can see here, because they keep snapping... They'll just keep going way out in the deep water comparatively. Now, this can be used to do a lot of interesting things. Now, you can build stuff like this. Um, it's not hard to actually do. All you have to do is come over to... The, I'll show you on this side. You just literally come up here and... Well, in the mode, you just find an area like this. You kind of... Put this down. Now, it doesn't have to actually be lined up or perfect. Just place a couple extra. You know, like, for instance, I'll swim down a little bit so I can see under the water. It does take a little bit of practice to get used to the weird having to swim. But that's it. That's all you have to do to really just start working on this. As you can see, it doesn't really actually require any type of foundation. But... Once you've got that down, you can do stuff like this. Let's say that, you know, I like these Ultra Sight, uh, but, you know, I want to put them down in the water. I could just come down here and find a spot for them, and there we go. I've got this now decoration. Maybe it's a sunken plane. Maybe I've put, you know, the some other object on this. But now I've got this interesting little decoration that you cannot place this in water. But, since it was technically on the platform on land before it went into water, it lets me do it now. As such, I can create a lot of things around the water that are sunken and different effects to this that I wouldn't normally be able to do. You know, maybe I have a sunken uh, car out there. You know, maybe they'll put out some other things that we can use for water but you know i just wanted to give out this tip hopefully it'll help people maybe i'll see some more camps by land and i hope you all have a wonderful week